Thanks very much. Uh, um, uh, I was sacked last Wednesday. Uh, we did, uh, after nearly 32 years, actually. And it's clearly a victimisation. Similar out for people who didn't see after the uh, paper was taken over. And, um, you know, there's been a great response from my union, my uh, fellow uh, union members at the advertiser. We're going to be on strike on uh, the 11th of June next week. And this Saturday, I'd like to invite you all to uh, a demonstration at the centre of all Actually, our workplace at Mamba is quite a way out. We've got a lot of workplace there, which is quite good. But to maximise the, the publicity against what's happened, we're going to call a demonstration in the town centre. Uh, I think everybody here will know that this is part of an offensive that the Tories are launching on workers because you know they know uh, that another five years of austerity is going to mean uh, a fight back at some point, which is why the first thing they did was to tighten up the anti union rules. Uh, so clearly, this victimisation where you know, you've got union busters who want to uh, uh, seize the moment is clearly going to be a pattern, but I think it gives us an opportunity to fight back. And I think the, the protests we've seen since the Tories were elected, you know, in London, but also a thousand people in Sheffield, uh, you know, shows the potential for that fight back, and I think the 20th of June is going to be absolutely massive. And, and you know, I know there are already a number of coaches from from Sheffield, but also of course from places like Rotherham where, where I work. So, you know, I think we have to link all those uh, fight backs together. And it's solidarity which is really the key. I mean, so far it's been fantastic. There are nearly a thousand hits and messages of support on our Facebook page. And, you know, we're, we're getting a lot of uh, uh, um, donations coming in and the support. So, you know, I think it's important we do that because our chapel have actually built solidarity into everything we do. Right from the 80s into the miners' strike for 12 months, you know, we support the miners. And uh, in fact, walked out at the time of the big closures in 92. You remember after uh, Major unexpectedly won the election, a bit like um, uh, uh, Cameron. And there was this Mexican wave of protests uh, in the October when President Biden announced big closures. We actually walked out with the miners on that first Wednesday, if people remember the demonstrations. There were two of them in the same week. And uh, right through to supporting the recycling centre workers who you know, as, uh, battling on after a number of years. And, and right across uh, South Yorkshire, we've supported workers and also played a part in, I'm sure everybody knows here in Rotherham, we've gone through an awful time because of the child sex abuse scandal, which has been uh, seized on by virtually every fascist in the country or in the world. You know, there have been demonstration after demonstration. And through the Trades Council of my own union, and we've stood behind the message of Justice for the victims, don't let the racist divide us. And that actually has turned the tide. We have, you know, stopped the, the racists um, uh, winning that, that argument. And of course, now we need to fight back against the Tories and the Commission, who's going to run the council now, imposed by people who seem to have gone. Suddenly, uh, they've been knighted, strangely. So, I think what I'd like to say is that we, we just have to unite the fights, unite the resistance. and. Um, and, you know, if Seth Blatter can go, <laughs> maybe Cameron can go just as, as quickly. And I would like to say that, you know, this is a sort of concrete note. In this room on the 11th of June, the day of our strike, there's going to be a, a Defend Our Unions uh, meeting, including members of my own union and also the uh, UCU uh, Lecturers Union members at Sheffield College who will be on strike uh, next week to defend uh, uh, themselves against redundancy. So we need to bring all the fight together, build the solidarity, and that way we can fight austerity and build the opposition and get the Tory down. Thanks so much.